So you nervous to be back in swimming in Malibu after last year? Oh yeah. <laughs> after the CO. No, no swimming by myself this time. <laughs> yeah. I'll wait for people to come. I'll no. go in the middle of the group. <laughs> if I have a bad swim, it's not because I can't swim fast, it's just because I'm being careful. <laughs> it was kind of scary yeah. when, it, when it happened. Yeah, just curious so. what I was probably. And then if you have a lot of people around you, they're going to swim away. Hopefully sh the sharks will swim away as well now. Ben was saying that it's actually quite common that there's sharks like just outside the waves, like the breaking waves or something. Just just behind where the surfers line usually is, he said. If you do compare them, like I'd much rather get bitten by a seal than by a shark. Then I would probably not be here anymore. Okay, stay behind the Put him in a small, small warrior shirt. Oh, he's planning a route. Where are you going, Christian? To the pool. Outdoor pool. Outdoor? Yeah, I think so. Yes. Under the blue sky. You never know how people are pulling up after Punta Vedra. Yeah. yeah, it's so much that can happen. Like yeah. 3.6k on the bike. It's short. And as you saw last year, a lot of people might be crashing on the course. So you want to stay on top of your bike as well. Mm -hmm. Beach swim with waves could be I'm not saying it's gonna be favorable for me but it's gonna mix up <laughs> mix the swim up even more you practice practice today yeah I gotta be doing some practice well, I'm not heading to the beach today though mm -hmm. but I guess tomorrow we'll go to the beach and the beach, yeah. look at the course look at the beach so look at the venue <laughs> Yeah, it's quite bright. Yeah, like the colours. <laughs> Have you guys met? No, I don't think Fanny, so. Fanny, this is Vasco. Vasco, this is Fanny. Michael. Nice He's racing you. for the oh, Eagles. Oh, you broke the arm. Yeah, yeah, I broke my arm. The seal. <laughs> the seal came in. Okay. okay. <laughs> What's the new bike? This guy every year no, comes this with is a new a, bike. Yeah, one. he gets Twice more bikes than the sponsored Three athletes. The old one. Come on, guys. Oh, the old one from one yeah. month ago. No, don't sit on it. No, you want to break? Uh, no, because I'm 38. Uh, and and you're 9? 10. 10. 10. Yeah. Close. Uh, but it's okay because yes. I haven't uh, enough uh, 
point. <laughs> Enjoy your interview. Thank you. See you later. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So you have to do it like that. The most of the Japanese is right. Another two inches. Wow. Can I help you with the group? I am. Yeah, yeah. Like I will end, but then I'll just come on. Always swim, no matter what. This woman's going to kill it. She's been training like a mad woman. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Hello everyone, my name is Will McCloy, I'm the commentator for Super League Triathlon and um, I'm very excited to be here again for the third year because Malibu Triathlon, I mean we travel all over the world with Super League but Malibu Triathlon is a very very special one and the reason for that is because obviously it's an incredible age group event that people have worked very very hard to put on. Uh, it's raised now over 18 million US dollars and as of about three days ago we've ticked over 1 million US dollars just for this event and I think that's absolutely incredible so round of applause for that. So we'll hear from a couple of people that have been instrumental in getting this event up and running again and we're going to start with a man that you may recognise from a very long council meeting a few nights ago, the Malibu Triathlon Race Director Brennan Linder. Thank you, everybody. You know, it feels like an election night. You know, when you come on, you're like, we did it! You know, and so I really want to thank everybody. You know, people that are here, it really, and then beyond to this triathlon family. Sport brings people together. You know, so it's really, it's a privilege for me to actually be a producer to see this arise in the world. And I say, um, number one thing, make sure you have fun. You know, we're racing out there, but yeah, race, but have fun, enjoy it, and cheer other people on. Yay! Last thing you can't be everywhere though, can you? Robert on the first lap, after that, I don't care what you do, just don't crash. Just don't overtake Robert. He'll be the one that'll be huffing and puffing at the front. I'm on the second lap. First time I've done it this year, this time round, uh, this, this way round, and uh, yes, yeah, car park isn't it? A car park uh, crit course, so it's a bit sandy, uh, lots of corners, and uh, I think it'll be tough because the other front will be really hard work, but uh, yeah, it'll be uh, a tough course. It's always a tough one this one with the travel and things, but yeah, uh, we'll wait and see. The course? Yeah. It's a technical one and challenging with. Uh, like the potential slipperiness with the sand from the beach. Uh, but yeah, it's going to, going to be intense with uh, only three laps. Yeah, like trying to get as much out of the bike time as possible. So to feel confident on the course tomorrow. So. Now you're supposed to be inspiring your team, right? Not making them feel self conscious. Look at that. She's a barrel! Get barreled. Hopefully we get some six footers, because I need some six footer waves. Currently it's not big enough. Hayden needs big waves. I need bigger. I need seven foot. I need Portugal's Zeth waves, man. Who's, who's going to struggle up? Me. <laughs> Always. Cold. No. No. <laughs> 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 
I think uh, basically on the way out, obviously try to swim under all the ways because if you don't, they're going to push you back. And then on the way in, just try to look back, pick a big wave. <laughs> Would you don't drink salt water. <laughs> all right, uh, it's a bit chilly, yeah. You'll be alright though. Nice, it's nice. It's starting to pick up now, so I think everyone's having a bit of fun out there. So. Do you manage to catch some surf, like surf them in? A couple, yeah, yeah, yeah. So hopefully they are. I can do that on race day as well tomorrow. How are you feeling about the bike course? Uh, yeah, not too bad. Like, obviously, crashed last year, so try not to uh, get history to repeat itself. So, um, But it's only short, it's like 3.5k, so a bit of damage might be done on the swim, and then we might be able to stay away. So, just uh, try not to let the blood rush on my head this time and <laughs> stay, uh, stay upright, I reckon. Another as a fellow Englishman. Where are you from? London. Oh. Well, good luck tonight. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. Are you racing? Um, um, I'm racing just in the relay, so I can't run it. Oh. Well, good luck. That's enough for you. See you later. So, no MG this week. So we got Tim. Tim was your assistant coach in London. He's probably a little bit more calm than MG. Sure? Yeah, he can, he can blow up. But no. <laughs> I think the Brits are shitting themselves in the water. Everyone I've spoken, I thought Beth Potter was going to have a heart attack. She, she looked, she looked nervous. Uh, yeah. Alex, he didn't look like it was that Alex, he's scared to death. And so they're, they're big. Has they seasick tablets ready for them? Yeah, yeah, they're, yeah, they're all that. panicking about yeah, it. Yeah, seasick yeah. tablets and so, yeah, so, no, so, no, Sophie, Sophie, Sophie gets seasick on a boat. Yeah. They're taking tablets because of the waves. Because they're worried about no. the waves. Oh, yeah, man. They're, they're just, um, yeah. yeah. So across the boys and girls, that's where after Cass, I want you to get some swim points for us. I hope I can surf. You can do it. Head down. Keep your head down when you catch the waves. Stay stiff and kick. Head down, ass up. Yeah, head down, ass up. It'll be calm tomorrow as well. Okay. Is the tide's going to be high, so it's not going to be... Oh, it won't be calm. It's eyes. not going to be calm. <laughs> <laughs> sharks, sharks mean you swim faster. That's yeah, the point, right? That's so, why. Yeah. So, that's yeah, I'll faster. put the swimmers on the outside. You've got... Um, I wouldn't mind winning one. I just want to make sure we shut out these sharks. Yeah. And if we can work with other people, get, you know, it's, it's now the game where we try and prevent them from earning points. Yeah. Yeah. Cassandra, she's rattled. I saw her riding on the course. She's not confident on this bike course she's not going to be happy and comfortable in the swim. If she's happy, she's a weapon. You know, Beth, again, Beth is going to come here. If things don't go her way, she's qualified for the Olympics, she's world champion, maybe she'll not be, you know, there's opportunity here, okay? Um, you know, we've podiumed here. It's going to be hard to beat the Sharks in the whole series. Yeah, I think we've got a great chance to get more than one, one male and one female on the podium here. Um, and I think it's just a case of really going out there and enjoying it. You know, it's a great series. You know, um, you've got to believe in yourselves here. This is, we've come a long way. You know, we've all had different seasons with the, with the Super League and outside the Super League. Some people have reached their goals, some people haven't. Every race is an opportunity to show why you do it and how much this means to you. So just race full gas. Um, yeah, best of luck. All right, everyone, thanks for being here. Uh, this is obviously a big race for us. This is our best opportunity to score a lot of points, so I hope you all understand. As a team, we all really need everyone to fight for every single point you can get, whether you're on the rivet and you're just wondering how much longer you're, you can go. Just try to push it as long and hard as you can, please. Uh, so when I would enter the water and by the time I got to the exit, it always seemed like there was a really good timing to catch swells. Like somehow the timing between the whole distance of the swim would give you an opportunity to catch at least one or two waves. The set timing was pretty good on point today. I think it would be similar tomorrow. You guys, you've been awesome. Thank you for your support. And 
because I've been trying to do everything I can to make this team good. And uh, it's a lot of awesome work, and I'm proud to be here. But don't make my work go unheard, all right? <laughs> and if you do, you ain't come back. Personal. Personal. Right, so here we are, back in Malibu. This is it. Round three, we are in the lead. We are like 230 versus 165. Okay, and I'm, I'm telling you right now that the other teams are coming after us. Like, they're coming after us hard. The, the, the thing that we have to contend with this race is the surf, okay? Yeah. The surf is going to be, you're going to have to lift those legs up. <laughs> There's a wading is going to be... I mean, because I know Tilly was saying today, she hasn't swum in the surf. Things can happen tomorrow in that surf. This is the thing. This is, the thing is, we know all of your ability, but it's the surf that is going to play a big part tomorrow. And everyone knows that. And it can be like one minute, oh, also, someone's yeah. doing really well, and next minute, they're right out the back. We know, we know how it works, so we, we have to just be ready for that. And this weekend we've got Magic Stu with us. So Stu... If all goes wrong, it's your fault, mate. You got anything to say? Alright, let's do the Magic Stu no, then. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Right, okay. Here we go. Who's Forget trap. Right, one. so I've got a bear trap. Actually, a squirrel's trap. Oh, fuck. How do you get that through security? <laughs> <laughs> right, let's get it for now. 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 Right, let's get it for in the squirrel. In the squirrel trap. <laughs> Best wrist of what would be. Yeah, here we go. Yep, right, put it in here like this. We're going to mix it up. It's alright, don't worry. Professional. Here we go. Right, it's going in the bear trap. Squirrel trap. Squirrel trap. <laughs> <laughs> now we get the card out. Trap, before my hand gets caught. Bear. Who's is it? The nine 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 here? Was it zero zero zero? Nine one one. Nine one one. Yeah, here nine one one. So speed down nine one one. Ready? <laughs> there it is. So I'm a magician. Thank all of our volunteers, lifeguards, LA County Life Law Enforcement, as well as City of Malibu. Now let's get ready to race. All right. It's time in Malibu, but who's doing their first ever triathlon today? Five, four, three, two, one, go!
I went halfway, but I should have. In the first one, I should have went hard right. But I only went hard like so I was right on the. Left. Here, that means the next race is just around the corner. So stick around. You know. feel great. A little chilly, not too bad. Just happy I don't have to jump in the water. Yeah. 6 a.m. Yeah. It's nice. I'm just doing the bike. Yeah, and what's, the, what's one thing you do to prepare for the Uh, eat a lot of pasta. I, 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 I kind of, I, I got hooked on the bicycle doing, doing these. And so I just kind of got to get back in the pool and do the run, the running kind of gradually. I'm, I'm pushing 40. So now I got to get the knees ready. I got to get everything going. So is the bike kill? Favorite part, yes, I love you? biking. I bike a lot. Awesome. Yeah. I see you found shorts. I found shorts. Yeah. <laughs> what were you wearing before? His <laughs> shorts. Because he's a very generous just, actor just, who, on the last minute, lent me his shorts. <laughs> Is that a good guy? What a good guy. What a good guy. <laughs> Paul, you're the you style them very well. Takes a t but, takes a village. It does. Just putting on the sunblock <laughs> for no sun. For no sign. For no sign. Oh, Check it in. Oh, careful, careful. <laughs> there he goes. Other side of the microphone today. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, just put it away from me. It was fun, yeah. It was kind of nice to be on the flats. Yeah, it was wild. Oh, it took me a second to warm up, though. How great it is to be out here with your son today in the Malibu Triathlon. Great job by well, you guys. Not my best ever, but it feels good to be done. What's your why? My why is the kids from Children's Hospital and the camaraderie 
with my Fox 11 team and everybody else out here. It's like a real family event and the energy is incredible. And you love doing interviews right after you feel like puking. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm grateful I didn't puke during this interview. <laughs> Push it! Oh uh, yeah. Oh. Congratulations. That was a good job. Out here today in Zuma Beach, getting it done with your team. Uh, I went through the whole thing. My team, I'm still waiting for them. I smoked them, but um, we did a good job. Swim, always surprising, always a challenge. I uh, still know how to ride a bike very well, but I, I did a good run. I felt good. I felt confident.